Let's just get this train running here. Now, here's the thing. Active playing really hot right now. Came off of a uh, upset victory over Lemon, yes, who is the uh, best Joker in the PNW, mm -hmm. one of the best players in Battle of Bees, or uh, uh, just British Columbia in yes, general. Yeah, British Columbia, yes. And, and again, he's a talented player, and Active's riding high on that trajectory yes. right now. But then again, he's going to contend with arguably Ooh. the best Mario in the world, that's, who just put 80 up on the board. Yeah, that turnaround back air was so good. Able to sneak in another back air, landing there. Nope, that whip okay. grab gets punished by Dark Wizzy's uh, super jump punch out of shield. Yeah, you know, for, for active, it's very difficult to not be starstruck here. With Lemon, yeah, he's a talented player, but the thing is... That's within you your know, own region, He's right? from your own... Yeah, you've seen him play a hundred times. You have some ideas. It's a Dark Wizzy. You've seen him play a hundred times, but they are on stages much bigger yeah. and much grander than your home turf. Yeah. But then again, you got a whole region to represent here. Dark Wizzy coming from out of state is making his mark known. That normal getup, not the right option against the Dark Wizzy that's coming straight at you. That back air is definitely going to find something. But Active's actually getting something started right now, putting a little bit of pressure with that little air, sneaky air dodge back onto the stage. Uh, maybe Active does want to go off stage. I mean, again, puts a lot of pressure on the board. And he actually ended up beating uh, Lemon with a really convincing spike. Yes, true, true. Active, uh, I. I was talking to a couple people in the scene, apparently uh, wasn't active for a very long time, came back and won a very fat tournament. Yeah, yeah, so. you know, I ironic that active isn't very active in this own scene, but, <laughs> you know, he's falling off a little bit, but again, still knocking the heads off of goats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and this might be one right here. Oh, well, yeah. Looking a little rough right now, but it is game one. We've seen two game five sets now. Oh, yeah, Are I wouldn't be surprised if this one go the distance either. Yeah. So playing hot today as active. I love that cape, actually. You know, slightly disjointed option. Not very fast, but again, it does reverse your controls for a second. So, yeah, yeah Active uh, trying to take a defensive approach there and nice. is uh, getting get punished. Dark oh, hang Wizzy. on. Hold on. He's going to get uh, poked through the stage there. That was actually kind of insane from Active. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, uh, that F tilt's going to get yeah. punished. Yeah, back throw. Yeah. Falco, kind of like character. Dark Wizzy with Rage at the ledge. Yeah, sorry, man. Uh huh. Dark Wizzy dropping his own band hammer right now. Yeah, okay. Oh, no double jump now. This is that linear recovery that we were talking about. He didn't make it, but he got some damage on the board. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll take that 15%. Sure. It's better than nothing. It's better than just dying. Yeah, yeah. That's just my opinion. I 100% agree. Go out screaming if you're going to go out at all, folks. Yeah. Ooh, down throw F tail. What an interesting combo. Yeah, and the no tech from active definitely allowed Dark Wizzy to get a lot of extra damage on the board. Yeah, I think like just putting on the pressure horizontally is kind of terrifying for active, being thrown from the center of the stage all the way out. And you kind of don't expect that when it comes to Mario. You expect to be brought up kind of high on the platforms. Uh, Dark Wizzy is avoiding that. Yeah, and we saw the first couple of up tilts that actually connected from active a second ago. He's got another string of them. He's to hit them a lot more consistently. However, Dark Wizzy only at 50% on his second stock. Yeah. Active on his final one right now. All right. Not able to find the down air right there. Active really searching for it. Nice answer. The reactions on Dark Wizzy is insane right now. Ooh, he sweet spots that one right on those toes. And that is game one going to the Mario Goat. Dark Wizzy. You know, like, you know, for a character that jumps all the time, those back airs are going to be strong. Oh, for sure, for <laughs> yeah. sure. You know, can we talk about how Mario can get two back airs out of a single hop? Out of a right? short hop? Right? Yeah. I love you, Jedja. Uh, You're my Jedja. guy. The goat's walking by He's right walking now. by. we got to pay our respects or we're going to get hit off next. I have to pay my respects. As oh, a, yeah. As a fellow Kirby player. Oh, absolute Titan. Yeah. Anyway, uh, yeah, you saw him walk past the camera there. God, what a, what a cool guy. <laughs> Fox! Fox Mario! Um, Wait, okay, throwback? Okay, so I don't throwback? know if any of y'all know this. This is one of the most aggressive matchups in the game. It is, for sure. And again, Dark Wizzy plays a little bit more of a passive Mario, waits for his options, but then again, these two, they just scrap, man. Yeah, yeah, they, they can too. Actually, it's funny, we, we say they scrap, but I feel like they just know how to pick their battles so well, yeah. right? And so it feels like they're within burst range almost all the time. Yeah. So uh, another thing about Mario back here that I was about to talk about, but then Jedi walked by and I got distracted. Yes. Um, <laughs> so, Break it down. dude, the fact that he can double uh, double it out of a short hop means he can do it with landing uh, back airs as well. Yes. And dude, at low percents, that is so easy to grab off of. You can get so many extensions just by hitting it. And dude, Mario is, is so nuts in this yeah. game. Yeah. <laughs> dude, they they took it away from Luigi. Yeah. <laughs> right. They gave it back to Mario. Yeah. Mario can have it. Yeah. Oh, nice. Look at the setups, but man, my up smash hits a little harder, baby. Yeah, that was a good answer right there from Dark Wizzy. Active thought he had something right there. <laughs> Dark Wizzy said, no, nope, I have a bigger head than you. Yes. 
Your legs are nothing. I know they're made of metal. My brain's rolling around here, man. I got a PhD. Yeah, th this, this guy literally runs his head into bricks. <laughs> yeah, and contrary to what y'all might believe, plumbers are actually a very, uh, you need to be very smart to be a plumber. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I am serious. They make a lot of money. Uh, yeah, they do. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, it doesn't sound like an appealing job, but they are the heroes we don't deserve. Oh, Anyway. I love you, man. <laughs> you're, the best. you're the best. I just like plumbers, man. <laughs> like, like, they're such nice guys, too. Like, they don't want much. Yeah. So, anyway, yeah. All Very right. intelligent man with a big up smash. Mm -hmm. Down air, nice. Rare to see, actually, rising down air, uh, especially on Fox. Normally, you see the rising fair from the ledge. Yeah. Uh, I kind of interested to see the reasoning behind it. Wow, Dark Wizzy with the tech chase right now. Active is falling apart. Huh? Okay, he's gonna go for that up. Oh, he's gonna SDI out of the downer. He's not gonna get the uh, strong hit of that other one, so he's gonna stay alive. That downer is ridiculously strong. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we see like a small controller reset from Active. So a little, little bit of like weird m inputs. I'm sure that dare, uh, rising dare uh, from the ledge is probably a misinput along with the uh, Firefox. Yeah, oh uh, man, but he's gonna miss the ledge there too. Yeah, you know, I wouldn't be surprised there. Uh, Dark Wiz, he's kind of running a uh, bit of a rampage right now. Falls off stage, wait out the iframes, comes back on with a down air. Not going to get touched. Active just going to let him get back on for free. Mm -hmm. Wow, the damage is definitely going to start racking up. Not able to get the second up tilt, unfortunately, for Dark Wizzy. It's it not Smash 4. Yeah, yeah. It, are we going to get a three stop? Uh, I mean, he's looking like he could. Oh, no. Oh, no. Double and more. Oh, God, Uppy. He's not going to kill. A lot of damage, though. My yeah. goodness the me. The parry! smash from center! Really? Oh, my gosh! Are you serious? Dude, okay, look. Fox is the fifth lightest character in the game. How do you react to four smash on that parry for the up tilt? Dude. <laughs> I don't even think... Wait, did he parry? Because I... He parried the up tilt. Bro. How do you know to... That move I mean, recovers look, much quicker than you think. I know F smash, he leans back so he doesn't get hit by it, but, like... He, he died at 74 before the hit from center stage because of Max Rage Mario. Yeah, that fireball is God, so I mean, strong. Fo Fox is light, but damn. All right, we're back to Falco. All right, and we're going to Kalos as well. You know, wall jumps for both these characters. Recoveries are going to be a little bit more versatile here. Yeah. I like the plays. I agree. I, I, I don't know if, like, the walls will really help out too much because I don't think we're getting, like, these uh, crazy edge guards, offstage edge guards or anything like that. It's just Dark Wizzy exploding active on stage. True, but they do give a little bit of versatility if you are caught without a jump for whatever yes. reason. Oh, definitely. So, right. yep. Oh, okay. yeah, hit him with the Glock. Yeah. Mario struggles with two things, the swords and projectiles, and hey, man, he's got a gun. Yeah, that's that's true. We, we do have cape for Mario, but you're not really going to commit to cape that often. Yeah, you wouldn't cape a laser. No. <laughs> Move transcendent, you're going to get hit by one anyway. You wouldn't download a car. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't steal a car. <laughs> you wouldn't reflect a laser, man. Yeah. Okay, the... Nice neutral that we have actually being played here, probably for the first F time. <laughs> just as I say that, Dark Wizzy just really throws out a forward smash. The really scary part about that, too, that didn't even sweet spot and almost killed. Yeah. From the other side of the stage, mm -hmm. by the way. Mm -hmm. I, I, I'm a little worried about DI now. <laughs> I am, too, but then again, down to forward air. Good amount of damage here on Dark Ooh. Wizzy. Wait, yep, see, and then there's that wall jump I was talking about. Yeah, yeah, Dark Wizzy can now go even lower. A smash just raw. Dark Wizzy knows he could just throw out these smash attacks against Active right now. Yeah, against close quarters characters, that up smash is really good because it's yeah. disjointed, it's fast, you know, it's a little bit of hurt box shifting, but on top of that, it's really hard to trade with that move. Look at that discipline afterwards. Dark Wizzy knows where he has a uh, frame advantage or not. Yeah, you know, you, you alluded to Karama before the set. Kid plays with a, a, a ball of fire under his butt oh, whenever he plays. Yes. He wants to sit down and he wants to beat you as quick as possible. Wizzy's a lot more cerebral. He's very slow, and that's why the two of them are such a dynamic uh, coupling yes. because Wizzy plays so contrary to him. And meanwhile, they're both like still at the top level. They're still yeah. very talented. A little bit of laser action right there for Active. Uh, well needed. Oh, man. Active really needs to get something started. Oh, well, he was looking for that spike, but... Man, we're saying Karama really wants to kill people. Dark Wizzy really looking at it right now. Yeah, man. <laughs> And, uh, okay, gets a nice grab. Okay. So Active playing a little bit slower now. He's starting to get his anti-air, starting to get his grabs, you know, really picking up on Wizzy's defensive options. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I, I do think you do have to play a little bit quicker when you are playing against Falco. You want to overwhelm this character so that they can't get anything started. You don't want to let them have the space to walk up, up tilt, F tilt. And I told you, <laughs> man, a that's a linear recovery. We don't see him go low off stage, but he will definitely jump off stage in those uh, linear angles. Yeah, yeah, if you're, if you're, especially, like, that high, and you have so much time to react. Dark Wizzy, so ready to play against Falco. Oh my gosh, and he read the roll in after the uh, back air, too. Weak hit back air, which doesn't have as much end lag or hit stun. Right. So, you know, very scary stuff. Double lasered. Uppies, nice. because he didn't want to get hit. Yeah, that, 
That's the best part about Mario's recovery, right? You can just, like, let it go, and you'll catch so many people who think they get intercepted. Oh, wait, hold on. Even game? I mean, I'm just saying, he could bring this back. Yeah, definitely with uh, oh, man. possible. You know, that flood has been really useful for, for some reason. I mean, it's just keeping active in the air for a little bit of time, and it's like slowing his fall speed, so Wizzy has time to readjust. And oh, You're so used to fastballing in this character. Yeah, that, that's definitely true. I do like the I do like the flood usage. I'm so glad yeah. you brought it up too. It's not something a lot of people think is a big option. Oh, F smash! It's been a big option. Crazy. Options. He landed on the platform after that up air when you thought he was just gonna fade away. Dude, what a 3-0, Wizzy! He came to play, and boy did.